This is my yard now. Hi guys again, it's me here. Here I'm Martin Ryan Emperor here. I do. I'm gonna do my predictions of backlash. So let's get down to the pay per view backlash empire. Let's get let's get down to this. Let's first start off for the United States Championship. Um. Jeff Hardy versus Randy Orton for the Universal Champion. I do like Randy Orton. I do like Jeff Hardy, but I will had to go with Jeff Hardy on this one because Jeff Hardy will be retaining the U.S. title because I think he's gonna keep that championship. And then for the tag t uh, for the tag team, uh, Braun Strowman. And Bobby Lashley versus Kevin Owens and Sami Zayn. There's a lot of people who want Kevin Owens and Sami Zayn to win. Me, I don't. I think Bobby Lashley and um, Bobby Lashley and uh, Braun Strowman. I think they're good team together. I think, in my opinion, I think, I think my in my uh, opinion, I think Braun and Bobby Lashley is going to win because I respect Braun and I respect Bobby Lashley. And then the next match is going to be a uh, big cast versus Daniel Bryan. Me, I still, uh, I don't, I, I, I respect big cast. When he when he came back to uh, uh, SmackDown, but I will have to go with the Yes Chapman. Uh, uh, I have to go with Daniel Bryan because I I think Daniel Bryan's really really good. I think Daniel Bryan I think Daniel Bryan is just of that win and and going to like. Go to I I would love to see Daniel Bryan versus AJ Styles, and I would like to see AJ start. I would love to see Daniel Bryan versus Samoa Joe. Um, more matches for Daniel Bryan for, you know what I mean? Because Daniel, I think Daniel Bryan is a great future for him. I think Daniel. I um, I still like Big Cass. Big Cass. I need. To get into his his a uh, his single pad uh, when compared to uh, with uh, split with Enzo, but I don't really care about Enzo. But hey ho! But I think Daniel Bryan is needs to win. And then the next match is for the SmackDown Women's Champion. Is Kamala versus Charlotte Flair? Um, I think there's going to be interference. I think there's going to be a lot of interference in this match. I bet people say, "Oh, what are you thinking, Martin?" There's going to be like, I don't know. It's like there's going to be interference of this match, but I don't want him. But. I think Kamala not win because I think Kamala is uh, going to drop that title. And then Solid Flair, I think Solid Flair, I want Solid Flair to pick up that uh, uh, SmackDown Women's title once again. I know what you're thinking. It, oh, we would we seen we would have seen um, Solid Flair hold uh, SmackDown Women's title. Yeah, yeah, I understand that, but I think Solid uh, Flair is one of my favorite females in the roster. But I think I think her needs to win because her's kicking ass. Uh, I like how they 
you deal with her, like put a rocket behind her and then just let her fly. And that's why I know there's a lot of people who like Sasha Banks and Oscar and, and all that stuff. Me, I like Solit because Solit is incredible, incredible athlete. And her movements are incredible. I like her storyline. I like how it, it does it. And just, it's amazing how her can sound sounds like that. But I think Solid, Solid Fair will go on to win this one. And then the next match is the Nia Jax versus Alexa Bliss for the Raw Women's Champion. I'm going with Nia, Nia Jax. I still like Sus, uh, I do like, I do like Alexa Bliss. But I think Alexa Bliss will not have that, uh, Raw Women's Champion because I know where the story's going. Because they want to keep Nia as that Raw Women's Champion till SummerSlam. But I think Nia is going to win that one because I know, I know the, where the story's heading because no one, Ronda Rousey to beat uh, Nia Jax and then go head to some, uh, SummerSlam if if that ever happens. Um, and then the next match for the Intercontinental Champion is Seth Rollins versus The Miz. To me, I will have to go with Seth Rollins because I want Seth Rollins to keep that Intercontinental Champion because there's a lot of high hopes of Seth Rollins. I think I'm glad he's not teaming up, like, all that stuff. But I heard rumours saying that Jason Jordan is going to be coming back on Raw. I hate Jason Jordan, you know. Jason Jordan is a loser, you know, Jason Jordan is a loser, but, and then it's like, I would love to see Seth Rollins, his, his new competitor, his, his new, what it takes Seth Rollins to the limit, and what is, what service he can do, it's like, Finn Balor, I think I respect Finn Balor as a, as a club Balor, but to me, He's still not that level with Seth Rollins. But put your comments down below. Which Seth Rollins match um, he, he, he would like to face. But who knows. But And then I think Seth Rollins will win this one. Because I'm certain this can, that's an easy match. Seth Rollins win that one. And then he's be still the Intercontinental Champion. And then the next match for the WWE Championship is for AJ Styles versus Nakamura. I love how the way this story builds of Nakamura and AJ Styles when Nakamura Nakamura's a great bloody heel. And he's trying to do a low blow like six times or seven times. And I respect these two competitors can do. One I got huge respect is Nakamura because Nakamura is entertain me. He, I love how done these two competitors storyline. I love it, but to me, it needs to be come to the end. I will I will watch this match all day, all day and every day because this story is incredible. But, I think, in my opinion, I think, I want Nakamura to win, I do, but I think AJ Styles will pick up of this victory, because I got I got respect to these two great competitors, these two athletes, and, but it's like, because they battle each other, like, like titans, but... And I love how they where the story goes, and it's it's like a like a film film recording. It's like it tells you the whole story, and I love that and how the storyline how it develops like Nakamura and AJ Styles. But I think AJ Styles will pick up the victory, and then AJ Styles, 
I would love to see AJ Styles versus Samoa Joe, in my opinion, because I would love to see that match because because that match will be a a good match. And then last and not and last and not least, the final one of the match, and then is Roman Reigns versus Samoa Joe. I know we had ups and downs about WrestleMania, um, the Great Royal Rumble, but that's all finished now. That's all um, ended with Brock Lesnar and Roman Reigns now start with a new story. Um, Roman Reigns versus Samoa Joe. Uh, at Backlash. Um... These two compares I respect. I like Samoa Joe. I respect Samoa Joe. What he did at Great Balls of Fire because he was that close to beating Brock Lesnar. Going back to uh, WWE Network or what? Uh, if you got, if you watched Great Balls of Fire, and you see Samoa Joe was literally that close to beating Brock Lesnar. And that's why, to me, I respect Samoa Joe for that. But, you know who I want to win is Roman Reigns. I bet you're thinking, oh, every single pay-per-view, you want Roman Reigns to win. Yes, I do. I want Roman Reigns to win. But I don't want him to lose all the time. I want him to be winning a couple of times. You know what I mean? But and I will and I'll say this again, I will I still not gonna give up on Roman. I n I'm never gonna give up on Roman and that's a fact. I like last night I thought I thought of something where I'm never gonna give up the guy, I'm not gonna give up the character, I'm not gonna give up what he's trying to make his legacy, trying to make like, his family proud, and I respect that, and I respect what he does in that ring. And to me, is like, if you've, like, to me, I think when, like, when we is a great guy, he is a huge guy. I know, I respect some people who doesn't like Roman, and and that's fine for me. If people who doesn't like Roman, that's fine. That's fine for me. I don't mind if you want to boo him or cheer him. To me, this this one fan was asking me a question. Why do you like Roman? Why you not hate Roman? Because I got my instinct and my my heart fill, and it's like where. I know this sounds not weird, but I feel his presence and felt his like he's there because you know like oh, you ever I'm trying to put to you girl for example where the heart of, like the heart of the cards you know what I mean where to me. I respect women as a guy. I put everything, like, I'm trying so hard, do my best, and just, and it's like, to me, I respect. Roman Reigns, what he has does and what his compliness, but that's why he's gonna beat Samoa Joe. But and it's like there's a lot of people saying, "Oh, you, he will take the money in a bank briefcase." Mm, not really. It's not good for Roman having that briefcase. Roman is more like a badass, more like the big dog, and it, this is his yard, all that kind of stuff. But it's like. I don't hate Roman. I really don't. As a fan and as a friend, 
for Roman, I just respect him. I truly respect him because I got feelings for him, and I, where as a human being and as a guy, as a character or as a human being, a real, real human being, outside or inside, I respect what he has does and what he, he compromise. I know there's not a lot of people who who want Roman Reigns to be the face of the company. You know what I mean? But I don't care if Roman Reigns loses this match. Like uh, if Roman Reigns, if Samoa Joe beats Roman Reigns, I I still don't care. I don't care if Roman Reigns loses. I don't care what if Roman Reigns wins. I still respect the guy. Same as if his if his championship, for example, if Roman Reigns have that universe champion, I still don't bother. I don't bother. I still respect the guy. It's not about the champion. It's not about prestigious. Is what is in him and what's his his compliments and what he's done and what he's done for his whole life and his whole career. Yeah, he wins many titles, and I respect that what he does. But as people always say, it's not the title. It's the man who you are today. And that's what Roman Reigns is. He is the man who he is today. And I respect Roman for that. As a fan, as a friend. And I respect Roman Reigns for that. I know there's not a lot of people who doesn't like Roman. But that's fine. And I richly respect that. This is what this channel is all about. If people who hate Roman Reigns. That's fine. If you want to subscribe. That's fine. You want a thumbs up? That's fine for me. And I still love every single one of my fans out there. Every single one of my fans. Who is like not Roman Reigns or who uh, are Roman Reigns. And I respect that. And I literally respect that. And that's what... To me, I want Roman Reigns to win, because that's my predictions. I think Roman Reigns needs to win. I want to be a good match. I want to be a, a like, I want, I want Samoa Joe and Roman Reigns to be this best match. This best match. And I love to see these two competitors. And then I will say, watch next for Roman Reigns. But, who knows, there's a lot of questions, like, what's next for Roman, but... After when he beats Samoa Joe at Backlash. And I will say this. I just want to thank you, all the people who watch my videos... Every single one of you who subscribed that button, I want to say thank you. Thank you. You are truly the best fans out there. If you like this video, please put your comments down below. If you like this video, please put your thumbs up this video. If you don't like this video, I don't really bother. If you like... Comment and subscribe. Have a, have a best day on Friday. I will see you guys. Check you later. And this is my yard. Believe that.